Welcome back. This is Project Titan Part 8. Let's get started. Alright, where's the thing? Right there it is. So, we're just going to be playing that Mario Portal thing today. I'm just really fucking, really fucking tired. So, we're just going to play this because it's really on. Okay. This is, besides Pac-Man and Mario, this is the only game I can really play while I'm tired. So, Oh, well, there we go. I don't know what that lag is, but... Of course, when I start recording, nothing works, so... How come it? Let me see if it just saved, saved it from the last time I did it. There we go. Fuck that. <laughs> this thing's just annoying the shit out of me. So, let me just speed run this game, then I gotta show you guys how to do it. Well, the first step is kind of turn, do the command code on the title screen, then go to the options. It's a cheap menu, turn on nice back, static label, and then the infinite time of live stuff, so then you're done. And just select the snap pack here in the bottom. Okay. We'll start the game. Simple. <laughs> I'm like, it's just a basic tutorial, but whatever. So you're just going to double click spam a lot. So you just push yourself through all these walls here. Uh, look at that. I pushed companion cube. Alright, I'm gonna just lower the volume a little bit because even though the volume's low already, I can barely hear myself talk. So uh, yeah. Well again, I should probably speak a little louder. So but we're just gonna turn up the volume on this. Because fuck it, why not break my eardrums playing some sort of fucking Mario game. Or whatever the fuck I'm... This Mario Portal thing, whatever the fuck I'm playing, I don't know. Let's just start... Um, okay, this one's trippy. I don't know how I did that. <laughs> I just started... I just pointed the um, mouse in some weird direction and started double-click spam here. There you go. <laughs> Game over. That was really, that was probably the best run I've ever had on this stage. Because off camera, holy shit, did I suck at doing this. Watch out for the tutorial at the end of the, at the end of the run, so. <laughs> so let's just get started with one three. Okay, this one's a, Real big pain in the ass. Not really, though. It was pretty easy. Not the fastest run, but not the slowest one. Not the slowest run either. The slowest run I had on this stage was about like thirty seconds, or however long it took me. I don't fucking know. I think my top is my but record best on the stage is thirty seconds. So. One four, this bastard stage. No, actually, no. Two two is the bastard. All right, this one. What I would do is try to click my way through here. There you go. Just straight victory. Yeah, victory after victory. Every single time with this too. One four seems to give me no trouble with this bug, so double click spam. Because fuck it, why not? Because the fastest way to beat this map pack is to double click spam your way through the whole thing. Yeah, fuck the puzzles. <laughs> because we're just gonna fuck around with the double click spamming glitch and try to beat the whole thing within like five minutes and then do a five minute. I do a 10 minute, 10, 15 minute tutorial on how to do this shit. <laughs> I too, and I don't really remember many of these stages, but I remember 2 2 being the bastard. 
Okay, ready? Alright. This is probably the world's slowest run. You're just slowly cruising along the floor. Okay. Now it's time for the close up. The world's slowest fucking cruise to the end of the stage while I discuss bullshit. Just kidding. So, the reason it took me so long to come out with another um, episode of this, or part as I call it, was I, I really wasn't like focusing on YouTube a lot. I've been busy. I've just been really busy recently, so I didn't really have too much time to record these videos, but now I'm just gonna start fucking making time to record this shit, so yeah. So, really quick, uh, once we get to the next stage, I'm going to take a snack break. I'll be right back. Hey, where the fuck is the control menu? There it is. Actually, no, I'm not going to pause because this thing has a bug where if I'm gone for just two minutes, this just ends, so I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'll be back in like two seconds. At this stage, all right. The goal is to they kind of like. There we go. First try. First try. It took a lot of double click spamming, but fuck it. The goal is to be above this overhang right here. That right here, what you're, you're going to want to do is turn around. And start trying to double click spam your way up. What you gotta do is kind of like go back a little bit to the point where you can actually go up one more level. Because that's our goal is to go up one more level. But I think that's the best we can really do here. I'm trying to figure out how to get up a second level here, but I think this is the best we can do. Because right here, we kind of have a little obstacle, but I forgot we could just spam click our way through there. So we get used to hearing that sound a lot. <laughs> All right, so here's the... And I fucked myself over, so now we have to go back to the menu and restart the run, so. Thank you, game. We're just going to restart from World 1, because... Okay. <laughs> so, I guess I can do the tutorial for World 1, so. For 1-1, one, one, pretty simple, just... At least I don't... What I just did, don't do. Just start double-click spamming, and you're at the end. Little less than like a minute world one is pretty much a cakewalk when it comes to this it's when you get to two two then it's like fucking nearly impossible that's what it's two two that's the real fucking bastard in this run because of double click spamming and having to hear that annoying bobbing noise like 30 times per second every time you have to do the glitch so it's really fucking annoying but here's one, two, finish in like three seconds. Like I said, world one is too fucking easy. It's world two is 
World 2 is the real bastard here. So World 2 takes a lot of work. At, at least for 2-2, two, two, it takes way too much like patience and work to really get into the wall there. But once you're in that fucking wall, you fucking basically, you just fucking made it to the end, basically. I'm going to see if there's a way I can just get across that pit just by double click spamming a couple times while facing the, the gun forward instead of pointing it at a weird angle. Yeah. Okay, right there. Then right here is where I would jump out and basically, there you go. <laughs> One three is a little bit more of a douche, but whatever. It's not that big of a deal. One four is a fucking cape. Well, just point your gun straight and start double click spamming, and you'll you'll win with like less than one tr less than like three tries. I would say three tries maximum for for this one, but it should take you at least one try. So is that too annoying? There you go, and right there, one four finished. That was about five, like five six seconds of gameplay right there. So much for puzzles though. Yeah. Where's the where? If there's puzzles, where the fuck are they at? Because I'm not seeing any. There are no puzzles here. Where the? If, what's the point of having puzzles if you have cheats to avoid them? This is a bug in the game that needs to be fixed. But don't fix it because I love using it. Because it shows how hilarious. What hilarious situations you can get yourself stuck in, basically. I just love it because it's a fun way to complete the stage. Quite annoying in some stages, but whatever. I don't fucking care. And I just fucking killed myself, so. Shit. <laughs> it's a fucking pain in the dick, though. It really sucks. It really is annoying to try shit like this, but once you get it, it's like, how did I not get this first try? 2-2 two -two is a real bastard, though. That's it is world. That is just very well known in, by at least me, when, as, as long as it can be, 2-2 two is an asshole, because let's just say very limited platforms and a wide open pit that you can easily just fucking fall right into. So, in that sense, fuck 2-2. Two -two. Because it's giving me annoying. And just like this stage, I'm going to try to kind of... And shit, we have to put back to the fucking menu and select World 2. This is what I hate about World 2 is that exact tr fucking trap. Because if you're, if you're not paying attention, you're just trapping yourself in a fucking wall. So, damn it, game. Why? <laughs> Alright, so, contact menu, shut up. What the f what can I say? This game is okay. Two one shouldn't have I shouldn't have had that issue two one where I got stuck, but that shows you when you're not doing when you're not doing this shit right, you're gonna fuck up and you're gonna get yourself stuck. When you have infinite time on let's just say you're not getting out of that trap, you have to quit. So <laughs> Fuck you, in all respects, game. For that trap, I hate 2-1. And yes, I have tried getting myself into this 
ledge here. It I haven't got it to work, so I usually just go. See, there we go. Now this part is a real trick. You gotta try to get yourself lodged far, than, far enough into the wall in order for this glitch to really work well. And just like a 2 1, fuck you, 2 2, because I got stuck again. That's the fucking second time I got stuck on, on a stage in World 2 because of that fucking trap above the screen where it's like, no, there's no way to get out of it. Fuck World 2. Cause it's always a fucking nightmare when you're trying to speed run this game because and then that shit happens so that's always fucking great when you're trying to speed run and you you just fucking fail a lot and it ends up being a slow run you get this run of fucking mario oh where it's like shit <laughs> Oh shit, my fucking knee. Hey man, I don't know what I did to it, but shit. <laughs> Alright, right here, I hate this. So, spam clicking. Drop through the laser. And fuck you, game. Because I just finished the damn stage. Now let's go to 2 2. So it can fuck up even more. So, fuck up. Let, let's go two two and fuck shit up more. Because reasons. Because I like fucking up things in two two a lot. Two two is the shit. It is the shit show. It really is. For this, for running this game, two two is a shit show. Except when you do that. And you actually do something right, then it's like, how did I not figure that one out? I've just been doing it the really annoying slow way this whole fucking time. And I'm mad at myself for doing it that way. Because look at that, you get this cool scrolling effect where it's like, oh, Mario's not at the end of the stage. Where the fuck did he go? <laughs> then instant transition to the next level. So there you go. And then that happens at 2 3. I forgot 2 3 was also a dick stage to fucking try to run. Because of that shit, too. So fuck 2 3 as well. Until I figure out how to bypass this stage with this glitch. I hate this stage. Even, even when I tried to plug it, I gave up on it because I was like, fuck it. There we go. 2 3 finished with a cool scrolling thing going on too, and then instant transition to the next stage because fuck making sense. That's why I kind of like that block pattern too. That's kind of a neat block pattern. God, I hate this fucking stage. This stage is a pain in the dick to run. <laughs> All of World 2 can be a pain in the ass to run until you finally figure out what you have to do, and then you're like, oh shit, I fucked up a lot. Okay, then this. Alright, then. Alright, then this part. And land on this platform and force myself to this wall and finish. Two four is one of the slower stages. I would, I assume. Trust me, I've tried the point the gun forward and start double double click spamming trick, and it hasn't worked. So 
I had to compromise with that slow, the slower method, which sucks because I I like seeing that cool stage transition thing where it's, it's like the camera's like scrolling, like catching up with Mario. I always found that hilarious. That I'm somehow faster than the camera, and just, like in uh, Sonic, like in Chemical Plant Zone and Sonic things, like shit. How do you that fucking fast? And I trapped myself, so shit. Three ones also a nefarious little bastard of a stage as well. Cause yeah, there's no easy way of getting through this stage. At least from what I've tried. Never mind. There we go. Three ones over. So now for the tutorial. Starting from uh, I. That that sucks. Now I have to watch through this whole fucking thing. Just kidding. Wait, is, I think this is where this map pack ends, because then we get to fuck around and I can show you how I did all this shit. Most of it is pointing the gun forward and double click spamming, so I'll show you I'll show you that for no fucking reason at all. Because I just want to run this game again and see how fast I can do it now. With no fuck ups. And we have finished. <laughs> That was too easy. 21 minutes out of trying to run again for five minutes. All right, so we're gonna start from world one and I'm gonna show you how to do this whole thing. Basically, if you have the three cheats that I told you guys to turn on at the beginning of the video, you have those turned on, just start the map pack and you're gonna do this. You're gonna point your gun forward and then just start double click spamming and you should be at the end in no time. This is the same case from, I think, for the whole map pack aside from 2-3. I haven't tried it in 2-3. At least, no, I, did I try it in 2-3? I, I keep forgetting, but if it's not possible, if there's a stage where it's not possible to do it in, then I would say kind of stick with the, um, fuck it, whatever. Just kind of like stick with the slower method. Like I had to do in like, I think 2-4. Or something. All right, this stage is a little nefarious bastard sometimes. But if you know the proper angle, so what I use is a slight downward angle. That's not too much to the point where you're going through the ceiling, kind of a slight downward angle to give you a little bit of height to bypass that, to pass over that laser and then pass through all the other walls. Again, I'll run that stage again, and I'll show you guys how I did it. And for those of you who didn't see what happened, I'll play. You can either rewind, or you can either rewind and slow the speed of the video down, or if you want to keep watching, keep watching because this is where it gets interesting. At least for World One, as interesting as World One can get. I have a slight upward, I use a slight upward angle on my gun, then that very, very slight downward angle on the gun to get to the end of the stage. I just use that, that upward, steep upward angle to kind of just pass through the bottom blocks so I don't have to worry about getting stuck in the ceiling of the stage. So, and then I switch that slight downward angle to give me a little height. Which isn't really necessary, but it's the only way to do it without dying a lot, so, yeah. Kind of almost the same case for 1-4, but you're just getting that jump height, then you're double-click spamming. You're going to point your gun straight and just start double-click spamming, like in 1-1. One, one. So 1-2 one, and 1-3 one, had the little down, slight downward angle trick, as I like to call it. Well... 1-1 one, one and 1-4 have this the straight double click point the gun straight trick where you would just point the gun straight and double click spamming. 2-1 and 2-2 two, two, I think have the same kind of thing as 1-1 one, one and 1-4. One, but 2-3 I'm not sure of and 2-4 I'm not sure of. So I would probably have to rewind the video when I, I um you know upload it. But whatever. We're going to start this shit now. <laughs> So 
So yeah. So two one I get it. And see this is what I mean by don't try to use a steep downward angle because then you go through your ceiling and you get stuck. And then look you have to do this where you fuck up you restart you choose the wrong fucking world and then you have to restart again to choose the right world. Hopefully you don't rush too much. Okay, here. So back in two one. As you see, I successfully gone past these lasers here. Basically, we're just using a very, very slight upward angle to get through the lasers, and then that very slight downward angle here. We use that downward angle. There's an easier way to do this, but I fucked it up, so. Yeah, you can probably use the point the gun straight trick, but I fucked it up, so there you go. Let's just go on two two where you're pointing the gun straight and firing. But this what this is a little nefarious bastard sometimes, so you might not get it on your first try. I sure as hell did not get this get two two on my first try because that stage was being a bastard to me, so hopefully it's not a bastard to me when I'm showing you guys how to do this, so Right here, just gonna point the gun straight and not do that. Point the gun straight, fire, and you're there. The slower method is to use the little um moving platform and just you know spam click through the walls. But you're gonna hear a lot of bumping like that, and you're gonna break your fucking ears. And I've been to listen to that like a million times in a row, so that's a faster, faster method. That's a faster method of getting through 2-2. Two, 2-3, two. Two, I think, has the same deal. If the fucking game window was just a little bit larger and I almost fucked myself over. See, you can't use the slight downward angle trick here because then you get flung into a fucking red laser. Then you fucking die and you have to wait for, for the level to restart itself. Cause that makes fucking sense. <laughs> Alright, so with 2 3, it's a bit annoying. It's a bit of a strange case. Because if you use the slight upward angle, as you see, you die. So you have to. You better hope you get the, the, you better hope you get the, the, you know, point the gun straight method done on your first try, because otherwise you just. Sometimes I can get, I can avoid dying somehow and actually get to the end of the stage, but most of the time, as you see, I end up dying on this part of the stage here because. Game. Because you know, winning is nice, but losing it, seeing how many times you fuck up is even funnier. And I died, so shit, I wasn't clicking fast enough for me to pass the, the hitbox of the laser. And those lasers have a bastard hitbox. Somehow, the hitbox on faster than the actual fucking laser. I never understood that shit, and I still, and I never will understand that. But finally, to get to the point, the gun straight method, and on the fifty fifth try of me, I just me fucking up a lot. So there's that. I should probably make a fail compilation on how many times I fucked up this run, but you know, or whatever. We're going to move on to the next thing. I think uh, Project 10.9 will probably be this game again, just a different map. I don't want to bore you guys again. You know, I don't want, want to basically upload the same video two times in a row. So again, point the gun straight. Hopefully... 
what I do is I use this slight upward cut to, to get through this wall. And then I use a kind of a, I use a, then I point to go straight or fuck that up and now I point the gun straight. No. No, I don't want to cut through there. And I fucked up again. Because this whole, this game fucking hates me. Sometimes. As you can probably see what my run of 2-4 is. Basically a repeat of what happened to 2-1 for the most part. Because this game was a complete dick. At least sometimes. Yes, I finally got myself through that motherfucking wall. Okay, hopefully... Okay, now I get on this platform and I at least try to bypass this wall here. There we go, finally. That took like a million and one tries to get, even though it shouldn't have really taken that many fucking tries. But whatever. So, I'll probably record part nine after I record this, then upload them both at the same time. And then the next, I, I guess I got to label the next part 10 and 10 too, because they're mostly the same. They're going to be just two parts of the same episode, so. Yeah, I'm going to split 10, I'm going to tell you to two parts of 10 centers. Because fuck it. Why the hell not? And then the game fucks fuck with me some more. And then there, you get that little, little middle finger. So 3 one is another nefarious little bastard level, so. We're going to try this again. There we go. We got it. Point the gun straight. Fire. And then you're at the end of the stage. How did I fuck that? How did I fuck that trick up so many times, though? It really shouldn't have been that damn hard. But for some reason, it was. Okay, so that's the end of this. Hope you guys enjoyed, and stay tuned for part nine.